Hey Monty Plunkers. In this video we're drawing a blocky doodle and then discovering a robot and a dog playing football. And stick around until the end to see how we found our robot and dog. All you need are some colouring pens, pencils or crayons and some plain paper. Hmm. Find a robot and a dog playing football inside a blocky doodle. So I'm going to start my blocky doodle with quite a light colour. I'm going to start up here. And I'm just going to create this block shape in all sorts of directions, overlapping some of the blocks already. Now you can take your pen off the paper if you want to do so. You don't have to do it exactly like this, but quite enjoy doing it this way because it feels almost less controlled. Like I'm just trying to see the space immediately in front of me rather than looking at the whole picture. It makes it feel like certainly a lot more random. So we're just going to fill up the space as much as we can. I haven't done this before, as you can imagine. Imagine if I was able to memorize this. I like to create some big spaces. I like to create some small spaces because I find that when I draw these doodle discoveries, the small spaces or the small blocks in this case offer an opportunity to provide a little bit more detail in our picture. Am I done? I think I am about done. Okay, so there's our blocky doodle. Now, within our doodle, we need to discover our picture. So what on earth can we see in here? Hmm. We've got to stare at the picture and see what we can see. So I'm going to start down here because I think I've spotted something. You see I've chosen a brown. And again, the reason that I use sort of a, a lightish or plain colour on the background is because I'm going to add colour over the top. I'm going to go over some of these lines. And look, it's not going to be a perfect picture. This is not about perfection. So please don't worry about that. This is about having some fun and seeing if we can find a picture within a doodle. We've sort of got a dog, <laughs> maybe. We've got a doggy there. What have we got over here? Maybe someone walking our dog? Now I can sort of see something here. There's an arm there, maybe there's an arm there. That looks like a foot to me. So I'm going to go over. Now I'm going over with the grey because I thought, well, it's very blocky. And if it's very blocky, most people aren't made of blocks, are they? So I thought, well, what about if we make a robot? A robot running with a dog. I'm just trying to use whatever lines we've got here. Can you see it's sort of sprinting or using this arm here? Is this a big old foot? It is now. Notice here that I haven't gone down all the way down to the bottom. I'm quite happy just to bring use a little bit of a line. So we've now got our dog, we've got our robot-ish sort of there. They're running, are they running or are they kicking something? Maybe they are chasing after this. Our square ball. Okay, I think we're going to have to join up some of these colours. So let's go over these lines now. Again, I tried to use some of the lines, but at some point we've got to connect it all up a bit. So look, we've got a line there as well. I'm going to go around the inside of our robot here. And that's really just to help bring it together and emphasize what we've drawn so far. And here, look, maybe we, if we do that shape there and that shape there, the eyes of our robot start to come alive a little bit. How about we do some dots for the robot mouth? Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Do some dots for the robot nose. But if they're playing football, we need some grass, don't we, really? So I might just go underneath some of these, well, on some of these bottom lines, look, with some green. Go underneath here, over to the bottom here, just so we've got a bit of a boundary our picture but let's add another green there as well. I'm going to go back to this picture here. I'm just going to use some of these lines 
draw some dashes down. We put something up in the sky, the sunshine, a square sunshine. The light we've done down here at the bottom, just going to use some of these lines up here, very top, to define our picture, the skyline. And there it is, a robot and a dog playing football, hidden inside a blocky doodle. Yay!